Don't let the enemy steal your cheeseburger. He is trying to steal your cheeseburger. Where do I get this from? How many of you guys like cheeseburgers? I understand that maybe not everybody likes a cheeseburger. Maybe your thing is lumpia or it's fried chicken or maybe it's ice cream, okay? Whatever it is, whatever it is that you like, the devil is trying to steal that from you. Nefarious is a movie about a guy who was a killer. He was a horrible killer and he was in prison and he was on death row. He was demon possessed by a demon named Nefarious. This demon took over his life because he allowed the demon to take over his life in incremental steps throughout his life. And the demon used him to kill people, to destroy lives, probably to steal as well, because we know that a demon's purpose is to steal, kill, and destroy. He was going to be killed later that night. And and there were times in the movie where it was the demon talking. And then there were other times when the demon would not be there and would allow the actual guy to talk who, who he was possessing. And so there were times, and you could tell from the, the tone of voice and things like that. Well, the prison guard came to him and said, hey, what do you want for your last meal? And the guy said, you know, oh, I want a cheeseburger and I want it to be well done. And he described the cheeseburger to the guard and the guard's like, okay, okay, we'll, we'll get you that for your last meal. And, and then the guy says, the, the, the convict says, and he almost whimpers it. He, he says, he says, please don't mess up my order. This is really important to me. This is really important to me. All right, guys. Uh, a meal is often important to us, okay? Especially if we haven't eaten in a while or especially if we're eating something special that we haven't had in a while. But in this case, it's really important because this guy knows it's going to be his last meal here on earth. All right, he he really wants to enjoy this cheeseburger. It, it He wants it to be the best meal of his life and he doesn't want anybody to mess it up. All right. But right at that moment, after he makes the order and after he says to the guard, please don't mess up my order, the demon comes in and takes control. Well, he was probably already there, but the demon t- takes control. And he says to the guard, you know what? Never mind. I'm not hungry anymore. I don't want a last meal. Wow. <laughs> All right. Let me put this in perspective. The demon and the minions of hell have taken everything from this guy. They totally ruined his life. They used him for their purposes, which are to steal, kill, and destroy. They they ruined his family life. They ruined every friendship he ever had, even if he had friends, I don't know, okay? They ruined everything, and, and they used him to destroy other people's lives. This guy's life is a wreck, and he's going to die by electrocution that night. The job is already done. The devil has already done his bidding. The devil has already won in this guy's life. Already. But... The final meal. It's not even important. It's not even important to Satan. It's not even important to the devil. But that final meal, which was important to that guy, the devil comes in and says, yeah, you're not even going to have that final cheeseburger. I'm going to steal that too. Why? Why would the devil bother with stealing somebody's cheeseburger because the devil is relentless. He never gives up. He is a kleptomaniac. He is a con artist that will try to get you to give up what is yours. He will never stop. And he has, if he was a human, a sickness. He has a sickness where he just wants to steal everything from you every time he can. And so in that movie, in that case, the devil stole a cheeseburger, a very, very important cheeseburger to that man. What about in your life? 